Except I missed all my big fish. Come on now. <laughs> all right, Steve. So you missed all your big fish. And I know at this point in your career, oh, I want to win. Yes, I know you do. I want to win. Yeah. Uh, anyway, had a great. You went after it. I know you. Went right. I, you know, my weight looked good the first day. It nothing went according to plan. My first stop, I caught a limit of fish. I was determined to catch a limit, and you know they weighed eight or nine pounds. Nothing special, but. I had to fizz every one of them. I was scared I was gonna lose a pound and a quarter fish and I knew I could catch some bigger ones up there shallow. So uh, anyway, my, I had a perfect pattern in practice. I don't wanna mention exactly what it was, but, but basically skipping a, a Cinco under docks. Well, I got down there, I went in first place, second place, third place, did not get a bite. I'm like freaking out. And uh, somewhere around 11 o'clock, I picked up a swim bait and threw across the face of a dock and got bit. And then a couple minutes later, I had that big six seven choked swim bait, and I missed her. And then I got another bump, missed it, and then I finally caught a four pounder on the same stretch. And then I came back around with a cinco and skipped in there where that six seven was and caught her on a cinco. But uh, anyway, I went in the next pocket over there. I missed another five, and then I, I finally threw under one dock. I had 15 over four pounds come after it at one time, and I caught one of them, luckily. <laughs> But uh, never saw them again. Second day I started where all those four pounders were and never saw one in the same spot, but I did catch four pounder in the same pocket. And, uh, but then I went all day, I'm throwing that swim bait. I, don't, I may have caught one or two more. I'm not sure I did, but uh, I finally, about 1.30, I went back to that starting dock where I saw all those big fish and I caught a 211 largemouth in another spot on Cinco under it. But, uh, but anyway, terrible day. I only had 11 pounds, even with a four pounder. And then today I went back to where I started the first day. And uh, anyway, I fished all the way in, just you know, blind fishing in, didn't get a bite. And then idling out, I saw a ball of bait with uh, two fish underneath it. And I fired a little kitek out there. Bait never hit the bottom. I caught a 4-2 largemouth, my first bite this morning. And then I'd, I went island around again and I saw him again. And anyway, got on top of him. And my, my third fish was like a three and a quarter spot that came out of 48 foot of water, which was pretty cool. But uh, anyway, I caught him and caught him. I got on a school of fish. It was every drop there for about five or six drops. It was just, there's 15 fish trying to get the bait at one time. It's so cool. But And then my, I went to another place and did the same thing, caught two or three more, but I didn't get a big bite. But, Anyway, I could have done that some more, but 11 o'clock today, I uh, I said, I gotta go throw that big swim bait. You know, wind's blowing, it was cranking pretty good, south wind, warm, they're gonna be up there. It was obvious they were not going when I got there, but I did get four or five bumps. I hooked up a four pounder, but anyway, I ain't caught a fish since 11 o'clock, so it wasn't the right choice, obviously, but, but again, we wanna win the classic, so. It's what got me up there to the top to begin with. And anyway, I'm still twitching over it. <laughs> I am. Well, thanks for the time, man. I yes, sir. It.